at you, Racer fans. Welcome back to Call to the Post 2013 edition. We're here on the first day of classes at Murray State. Guys are getting their books, getting their physicals, getting their equipment. We're getting ready for day number two of the semester, but the first day of off-season condition. On the board behind me, you can see we got a red group, a blue group, and a gold group. The goal here is it's an individual effort board where our guys get graded each and every week. We got all the guys on the teams named up here, no particular order, but the goal by the end of the semester is for all of these players to be over here in the gold, and if we're able to do that, we're going to have a championship season. It's an exciting time, but we're getting ready to jo be joined by my main man, Craig Sweeten, the Murray State football strength and conditioning coach. I just discussed our individual board, but now we're going to go to our team board. Got my man here, Coach Sweeten, the, the force behind racer football. But as, you, as you've seen previous calls to the post, everything has the racer, horse track, horse racing theme. And his genius thoughts in the offseason, he's come up with a plan to stay intact with that theme, um, to get our guys more motivated, more competition during the offseason. Coach Sweeten, how about explain to us the board that's behind us? Yes, sir, Coach. Uh, <clears throat> we divided the team. Uh, half of the team is the gold. Half of the team is the Navy. Has nothing to do offense versus defense. It could be defense, defense, offense, offense. But basically, we've broken it into three parts. Uh, those parts are triple crown training, basic training, and the Belmont, keeping with our racers theme. Uh, the first four weeks is our triple crown training, where every single day in the weight room, it's going to be team gold versus team Navy. Winner at the end of the day, keep the competition level high. The basic training is still with our gold versus Navy, but we've added some running and conditioning components to it. And then we'll finish off right before spring break with the Belmont, which is gold versus Navy, with lifting as well as agilities and some football specific movements. In the end, we're trying to make the best championship level football program that we can. Coach, we really do appreciate it. Coach Sweet does a great job with our guys. And now after that, as we get through the semester, um, what's the name of spring practice? What kind of competition is that? That is the Preakness. The Preakness and then the Kentucky Derby. Kentucky Derby is when we finish the end of the semester with all of our racer ball, dodgeball, tug of wars, mm -hmm. steeplechases, all the fun games that our guys enjoy. So, hey, the man's on board with the racer theme. He is the driving force behind our guys. Our guys are going to be better conditioned than ever before. This will be the first year we are in the newly renovated weight room. Last season we had to work around all the construction, mm -hmm. so we're very excited about it. But last night on the 13th of January, 7.30, I turned the team over to Coach Sweeten because I don't want to put any pressure on him, but what he does in these next four weeks will determine the success of the racer football team. We're going to be back each and every week on Call to the Post. we got some exciting additions coming up. We hope you join us. As always, Happy New Year and Go Racers!